Hello, everybody. I'm uh, WFAA meteorologist Jesse Hawila. I want to give you an update on the tropics, namely the Gulf of Mexico. Right here near Cancun, we have an organizing area of thunderstorms, and this is now Tropical Depression 10, soon to be Idalia. Uh, and we expect this to become a tropical storm early in the week and a hurricane by the middle of the week, which is also expected to make landfall in the southeast. Right now, the track takes it into the Florida uh, area, and that's Again, we're early, so it could change, but here it is. There's not a lot more information than this other than we have the thunderstorms there uh, in Cuba, and here's what's expected. Let me show you the track. So by tomorrow afternoon, it's still a tropical depression with winds under 50 miles an hour. By Monday, we expect to have tropical storm medallia with winds of a, 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 somewhere in the, the 50 to 60 mile per hour range. As we go through that time here, there's Tuesday at 1 o'clock in the morning, 60 mile an hour winds, Hurricane Adalia sometime either uh, early Tuesday morning or into early Tuesday afternoon, winds of around 75 miles per hour. Then Hurricane Adalia is expected to make landfall. Uh, you get, this is called the cone of uncertainty. So Panama City down through Tampa, that right now is the consensus on the track as it kind of moves into the southeast. Could be a uh, category one, possibly a category two hurricane uh, during landfall. So again, that's the very latest on Tropical Depression 10, which is soon to be a Dahlia. We'll have more information here on our YouTube channel and WFA.com as it becomes available.